Welcome to my new channel <clears throat> and uh, drinking the water here. I use these to, instead of cans and bottles of Sprite, when I can I, I use Resoft this cup. I've used this cup maybe, maybe 30, 40 times in the last five months here in Chiang Mai. Three, four months in Chiang Mai. Five months, I don't know how long I've been here for. Recycle, reduce, reuse. Reduce, reuse, recycle. 172 million views. Oh, that's that good. Oh, I sound fucking piss poor. Am I even looking in the right spot here? 5,000 videos, I don't even know how to look in the camera front one. Here we go, it's that one over there. Boom! Let's do it again. 172 million views. <laughs> well, high five me. Alright. You're gonna do it with me. Yeah, yes. 200,000 subscribers. Oh! <laughs> Went back at Jurassic Violence, Okay, aim for the elbows. Alright. Uh, and uh, 3,400 something videos, I think it was 3,467 videos, gone, done, fin all finished, gone. What hasn't gone though is the legacy that Duran I leaves, that I leave, that the high carb, carb the fuck up, raw tool for 8, 10, 10, whatever you want to call my messages. Eat fruit, eat more rice, eat more sugar, carb the fuck up, sleep water, sugar, ride your bike, burn fat, not oil, get it fucking done lifestyle, attitude of gratitude, that still lives on. So the trolls did win this round. They win the rounds, but I'm back in fucking a few hours. You know, so people can delete you off the internet, but you can come back like that. What you can't bring back though is all the old videos that people had linked on their blogs, or people would watch every day for inspiration. They get on their phone and then, and that's that's where I feel the saddest is. It's not the hundreds of the thousands of dollars that I'll lose. It's not that. I mean, money is like I've made a lot of money. I understand what it's like to be dirt poor. Actually, I don't really because I'm an Australian. And if you live in Australia, you don't understand what's hard to be poor. If you live in the Philippines or Bangladesh, where countries where people are really doing it tough, actually even in the Philippines, I mean the Philippines is an awesome place, but I don't think anyone in the Philippines dies from starvation. They live pretty hardcore, very hardcore some people, extremely hardcore, but I don't think anyone dies in the Philippines. I could be wrong, but there's people, there's over 30,000 kids dying every single day, under age five around the world. So as an Australian, I can't complain too much. Yet we have Patreon strong e-beg motherfuckers in the vegan community who are like their eyes are bugging out. They're always like itching their nose, and, like, and that's they're fucking drug users in my opinion. So I'm not gonna be like them. I'm not gonna go, hey guys, I've lost my channel. <laughs> I'm really triggered and I need money. Donate to my Patreon so I can pay off my old drug debts. And you keep using drugs and call myself sober and like. <laughs> anyway, I digress. I just thought I'm gonna have a little rant there. I like to have a full rant, get off your chest, say what you mean, mean what you say. But there's too many fucking people in the vegan community doing drugs and e-begging for it. Patreon strong, motherfuckers. And they go, to, they get a bar, they go, I need to go to Bali for holiday. I need to, you know, chill out. So they get their money from their followers, they go to Bali, and then they go to a slaughterhouse for a couple of minutes. And then they go, oh my god, I'm, I'm having a breakdown, I, I, I need another holiday, guys, give me more money. You know? What about the workers who work in that shit six days a week, 12 hours a day for fucking five bucks a day, maybe, max five bucks a day. And you go back to your fancy hotel room and you have a cry about it. That's why I can't cry about what's going on in my YouTube world. Because it's not really real life. Real life is those kids dying every day from starvation. Real life is those animals in the factory farm, or the it's animals getting killed in general for food. That's real life. And so I can't be, oh, poor me, poor me, give me money, give me money, give me money. Activism isn't being a fucking e-beggar on the fucking YouTube doing one video a week from your fancy hotel room in Bali where people have paid five bucks a day to clean it. And you're spending a hundred bucks a night to fucking... Anyway, I'm digressing. I just feel that... Now I'm scratching my nose. I actually have a little bat in the cave. I was trying to flick him out. <laughs> whenever, you, whenever you see someone quick constantly like, mm, and they're picking their skin, they've got little spots in their skin and stuff like that, then you can see some narcotic abuse, in my opinion. Um, especially the eyes. The eyes, like, they, they bug out, they bulge out. My eyes are very inset. I'm, I'm lean, that's just from 3.9% carb the fuck up, full native brass status, but the narcotics get that bulbous eyes. And they're like... <laughs> and the nose gets really skinny. Notice that? I don't know why, but... They get this real pointy little nose, you know, this little Cinderella nose. 
I don't know if it's the cartilage burning out from the snow. I don't know. Anyway, I'm digressing. <laughs> I'm the fucking... Oh, anyway. So that's, that's nine years. I thought about last night. I'm sitting in bed. I'm watching the, the doco, uh, the movie Into the Wild. And I'm sitting there and, and I go into my tumbler and I say, okay, yep, done, finished. Dune Riders down. Ask Dune Riders down. Full Nutty Bras down. Under the channel's down. Deleted, gone. Contact YouTube support. They said, it's spam. Your channels have been removed as spam. We don't think we're going to put them back on because you've been buying views, um, etc. And I was like, well, I haven't. They're like, well, we don't know that. We can't prove if you bought them or someone else bought them. And I'm like, well, you guys need to do something about that because that's a massive YouTube glitch. If a troll or a bunch of bored vegans out there or whoever's out there, no, they're not even vegans. These people aren't vegan, man. They're just vegan for fucking marketing reasons. They're vegan to get pussy to make girls pregnant and get these vegan girls to have abortions. They're just fuck boys in a bad way. And so they, so they just say, we'll just call them trolls. That's what they are. I'm not, they're not cockroaches, because cockroaches are beautiful little creatures. We'll call them like trolls and scumbag trolls. And um, <laughs> so people can get your shit deleted really fucking easy, man. Bots, look it up. This is, this is, this could, I could be set in history right now. You know, I've got, I've been talking this, uh, hopefully, anyway, that's another story. But I think this is going to hit the media big time. Because if trolls can get my account down with no strikes, I've got no strikes, no warning, just shut down. It might come back, it's probably not going to. If, I can, if my channel can get taken down, I'm a verified person, YouTube partner, been on for nine years, 170 million views, 3,000 views plus. I've got YouTube contacts, first name contacts. You know, If I, my channel doesn't come back, this is a big issue for YouTube's security. If trolls can just go on there and buy bots from whatever countries wherever, on someone's channel they don't like, that's pretty full on. That's pretty full on. And you just get it deleted like that. So, um, if I don't get my channel back, I'm still making videos as I'm making videos here. What I'm saying though, is if I don't get it back, then it, I guess it'll be a big uh, warning or canary in the cave of how unsecure any YouTube career is or any YouTube channel is. And any career is unsecure. You could lose your job anytime. You could die anytime. Life's just insecure. That's just, that's just, you know, that's just life, man. You could get born with some incurable condition when you're three years old and, and unfortunately pass. You know, it, that's just the gamble of life. That's life itself. People can come and go in and out of your life real quick. I could die today, man. Who knows? You know, so live in the moment. Don't take things too full on. It's hard. I know it's hard sometimes. But <sighs> breathe with me. Breathe with me. Um, so I, I think it's, that's full on. Some, you can get someone's channel deleted for maybe $1.00. Two dollars, you can buy a thousand views on YouTube. I've been googling up this morning and last night. You know, you go, there's all these little bot sites. You can get someone's channel deleted, potentially, like mine was deleted for a couple of bucks. That's like, that's crazy. I mean, what, what, what's the, we're going to call this a YouTube hit now? You know, a YouTube hit, hit man, a YouTube bot hit, hit bot. Um, so I think that this is a uh, what's that channel called? H H three or HB three or something like that. Uh, I think this is a good topic for them to do. Talk about this, that uh, maybe sharing the video with them. But you know, my channel got deleted for spam, and I can guarantee you, it wasn't for me. It was from people or a person, uh, Botox or not. Someone did this, uh, and we can't prove who it did. Because that's the thing, you know. I can we can make speculations. We can talk about Botox scandals and all this other stuff, so pelvis and stuff like that. But we can never really prove one hundred percent. We can just have our little. Uh, Coincidences. You do a video about Botox, then next two days later, the channel's gone. Maybe it's a coincidence. Maybe it's a coincidence. Um, but yeah, that that's definitely uh, this is like this is like a nuclear war. <laughs> this is like nuclear war on YouTube. If, if people, someone, the team toys said, "What? Don't tell people about that. You can get someone's channels taken down for a couple of bucks because what if they take your channel down now? But they already can take my channel down. You know what I mean?" But I want to educate people out there, put it out there, someone who had, hundreds, who had 172 million views and got lost like that because someone out there saw some people or some person, whether they're from Ecuador or Australia or whoever, or, or uh, San Francisco, someone did something and my channels, channels got done. So if it can happen to me, it can happen to you, guaranteed. Um, so I would, I would like YouTube to do something about it and um, you know, just because otherwise it's gonna, 
It's, you know, with the apocalypse and all this stuff going down. I think ab apocalypse was great because it showed you who's just an e-beggar, who's here for money and spam, and who's actually a genuine, caring person in the community, which is, no one really is. I mean, <laughs> look at the people I've brought onto YouTube. Look at them all. 99% of them just narcissistic, money-hungry, handbag fucking basics. You know? Oh, Duran's Chubbot lived. Oh, great! Duran helped me out when I first started. He was the best ever, but... <laughs> You know, so it's social climbers, man. It's, it's where we live in. You're like people's best fucking guru, and then once they get a few views or whatever, they're like, I don't even know you, man. Who, why, what? Stop creeping around, man. Anyway, first world problems, man. First world motherfucking problems. So I'm not here to complain, bitch and whine. Um, I would like YouTube to do something about this bot thing going on, because that's just, that's not, it's not fair. It's, it's, if it's that easy to take someone's channel down, that's really, uh, Unfair. It is unfair. Um, but that's life's unfair, isn't it? And YouTube is life. I, I definitely identify as myself as a YouTube content creator, and that's why I'm back on YouTube in a few hours. So I'll never stop doing YouTube. You know, that, I, can, I can have my account deleted every single day. I'll still sign up another account and create content because that's what I love doing. I love sharing with my audience, and I'll only create content if people keep watching it. You know, if no, if I get zero views per week, I'll stop. I'll do that. I'll go back to doing something else, working in the bike shop or whatever. What was that? Oh, that's a thread. That was an assassination attempt. Um, you know, I'll, I'll do something else. Um, you know, helping out in orphanages or... I mean, I do that anyway. Free time, do stuff like that. What will I do for money? I don't have to worry about that because I'll be set for life. I am set for life. Here's the thing with money is... If you need a lot of money, then you're always fucked. You, money will be your, you'll be money's bitch. You gotta make money your bitch, and in a nice way. And we'll make, make money your friend. And that uh, you guys, you, you work together versus you working for money. Make your money work for you. Money wants to work for you. Um, but I digress, but it, it is interesting. I like doing these videos, one cut, no jump cuts, no script, just saying it how I see it in my mind, dazing off into the clouds. No stims needed. It's not strong. <coughs> um, yeah, it, it is a funny world out there, but it's, this is this is all new stuff. I think I'm the first big YouTuber to have my account deleted because of bots. Let me know in the description down below if you know anyone else. Anyway, we'll do some more videos, more questions. I wanted to touch base with my crew because be like, "What's going on? Let us know. Are you okay? Is there anything we can do? Do you need money? Do you need help? Do you need this?" I'm good. I'm always good, gang. You know, if you want to help me out, maybe. Maybe if you want to help, I don't ask for favors very often, but if you want to help, oh yeah. If I've ever helped you out, if I've ever helped you out, then if you want to help me out, maybe your top comment on your next video, you can pin it, you can leave a, you can say, hey, for anyone, this is doing on this new channel. You don't have to engage in any drama, I don't want to take any sides with me and such and such. I don't understand that. But if you want to help me out, uh, you could go on your next video you upload and pin Make a comment, this is Duran Rider's latest video, blah, 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 blah. Just, just leave, just do not, for those who are looking for Duran Rider, here he is. Pin that on your next video if you want to help me out. That's all I ask. I don't want your money, I don't want tears, I don't want anything else. I enjoy your viewership, I enjoy co creating content, sharing, giving, learning. But if you do want to help me out, a little gesture, that's all you can do. That's all I expect. I don't even expect that. But if you do that, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Life goes on. Like I said in the other video, if life gives you lemonades, no, if life gives you lemon, make lemonade and pour extra motherfucking sugar in there. You know, have it so sweet, people will say, would you like lemonade, sir, with your sugar? Carve the fuck up, 